To create a user interface, we need a root panel. So we're going to create a new class. We can call it whatever we want. I've called it HUD, and I've inherited root panel. Then we're going to go to our games base class, and inside the constructor, if we are a client, we will create a new instance of this HUD. And now we can create our first Razor component and display something on the screen. To create a Razor component, you simply create a file with the .razor extension. Let's create hello.razor and display some text on the screen. So let's go over to our roots panel and add it as a child. Now if you press save and go look in game, you will notice that nothing is showing up yet. Now, because we've created this component inside of a constructor, we will need to reload the game in order for it to show up. You can do this with the game launcher in the toolbar above. And now we can see that our hello razor is showing up in game. Let's go back to our razor component and style this text so that it's a little bit easier to see. We can do this using the style tag inside the razor component. We're going to use the hello selector, which matches the name of this component and everything inside of it, and your basic CSS properties. We don't have to reload the game this time, we can just press save and see the changes in real time. And now I'm just going to style this up a little bit to have black text on a plain white background.